drama off the stage. A Long Island school's rendition of Thoroughly Modern Millie is sparking some protests because some say the portrayal of Asian characters is downright racist. News Force Erica Michael is live in Huntington to talk more about this controversy, Erica. Well, Natalie, there is an absolute social media outrage about this play. One mom told us that she first caught wind of this when her daughters came home and said students are making fun of Chinese people. She says that concerned her, and then that feeling grew to disgust when she saw the play. How can you think it's not a racist show? Shu Mei Yi Matthews saw Huntington High School's April 5th performance of Thoroughly Modern Millie, a Tony Award winning musical based on the 1967 movie starring Julie Andrews. It depicts a woman's visit to New York City and showcases an effort to lure her into prostitution. It was the portrayal of three characters that alarmed some Asian American parents, a woman who spoke in broken English. This Chinese woman um, with a bun and uh, heavy makeup, chopstick in her hair. And two brothers in traditional Chinese outfits who flap their arms behind their backs. E. Matthews says to her, that movement symbolized pulling a rickshaw. When I see those boys walking like that, you know, it, it just, I, and I don't know why people think it's not racist at all. Uh, maybe only if you're Chinese, you can see it. E. Matthews doesn't fault the students who performed three times. She's calling out the administrators. Huntington superintendent told us there are obviously multiple perspectives on the theme and content of the play. Those involved strive to cast and perform the roles with integrity and would never want to upset or insult any individual or group. All are committed to viewing this situation as an educational opportunity, one that allows for open and productive discussion on any of the issues presented. I wish this show disappeared from Long Island. A stunned mother who says she's been left to explain the unexplainable to her girls. And my younger one said uh, people um, coming up to her, telling her, oh, now I know how to speak Chinese. It's Ching Chang Chang, Ching Ching Chang. So she did tell us today that she does not think the school is racist. Again, she's just upset with that play. We also want to let you know this, that last week, another town here in Long Island performed a similar play, the exact same play that was Levittown High School. Uh, in that situation, the superintendent says after the backlash there, that district will no longer perform this play. In Suffolk County, Erica Bicot is for New York. Thank you, Erica.